Our world has fallen to fade. Its great works long since complete. Its storied civilizations long since fallen to dust. The greatest legends of Elysium long since forgotten. What was once a land of promise has fallen to the ravages of war. And it was in this, our most desperate hour, that the greatest of Elysian tales began. The lone warrior stood against an army, slashing his way through all who opposed him. The mob stood no chance, and the soldier showed no mercy. But despite his victories, his skills, his ruthlessness, the valiant soldier would perish on this day. Not to the mob, but to a single child. Dust, dust, arise. What? A talking sword? What are you? Only that which you have summoned. Summoned? How? For what purpose? That I do not know. But we shall learn in time. Now rise, and claim the blade of Ara. Stop! Stop right there! And who is she? Me? I'm Fidget, guardian of the sword. No offense, but aren't you a bit, well, small? For a guardian, I mean. Hey, I just look after that thing. After 200 years, nobody expects the sword to just fly off and start, you know, talking. I'm kind of wishing somebody told me this was part of the job description. Or maybe they did. And I'm sorry, I think I misheard before. You said your name was Fidget? Hey, this isn't about me. You're the one who's got my sword. How about you tell me your name? I'm... Uh... Calm yourself, Fidget. His name is Dust, and he is the one who woke me from my slumber. So, Fidget, then? That's me. And you're... Dust? It would seem that way, though I can't recall that name. So, what is this sword? I am the Blade of Ara, and you, Dust are my fated sword bearer. Yes, well, that's all great and everything, but I think it's about time I got this sword back to the clan. I can't let you just leave with this sword, Fidget. Right now, it's the only thing that knows who I am. I don't even know how I got here. Hmm. Well, then you leave me no choice. I... I, I challenge you! <sighs> I don't have time for these games, Fidget. Indeed. Time is of the essence. Fidget, you will join us. I will? Oh, well, okay then. Come, Dust. We travel east.
What is it, Fidget? Well, my kind has what you'd call a sixth sense. And there's something just ahead. We found a locked chest. Well, what are you waiting for? Smash it open. That would be unwise, Dust. These chests are protected by arcane locks from the last era, and are well beyond my capabilities. I suppose we'll need a key, then. Fidget, dust, focus. Remember what you've learned thus far. summoned you to control this power? It is unlikely, Dust, that I would awaken from my slumber for such selfish reasons. There is a village beyond these woods. Perhaps finding it will aid in restoring your memories. And then we'll be in the clear, right? No more monsters? Fidget, I think things are about to get a whole lot worse. <sighs> and to think, this morning started off so well. At least take these feeble fruits. Something tells me you're going to need them. Bear witness to the dust storm. I like it. Hold the secondary attack to perform the dust storm. But beware, skilled as you may be, you cannot maintain the storm for long without hurting yourself. In that case, maybe I can help. If you press the super ballistic fidget action button of power, I'll perform an attack so spectacularly awesome that it'll produce emotions you didn't even know existed. 
Please contain yourselves as I demonstrate. That was, uh, very pretty. Hmm. Well, maybe I'll just keep the rest of my repertoire to myself. I'm sorry, Fidget. I'm sure it'll come in handy somehow. Actually, Dust, between the three of us, this could be quite useful. The Dust Storm can manipulate Fidget's projectile into a more powerful attack. Observe. my power, it'll use up a bit of energy meter. You can recharge the meter with melee combos. Yes, Dust. Between your combos and Fidget's own powers, you can achieve a higher hit chain, which will yield bonus experience after each battle. However, if you are struck by an enemy, the chain will be broken, and you will lose your bonus experience. All right. I think I understand. If this is all too much for you, you can check out the help screen via the pause menu. Thanks, Fidget. I'll take a look if I'm ever in trouble. Maybe hoping you could tell me. Oh, silly me. I seem to have dropped all my detailed maps and navigational equipment chasing after a crazy flying sword. I'm sorry I got you mixed up in this fidget. Well, you should be. Digging my sword, getting me in trouble. You know, now that I think about it, this isn't the first time I've seen this view. I've stood here before, in this very spot. Then perhaps you recognize the village at the base of these cliffs? It's hard to make out from here. We'll need to drop down to the valley floor if we want to get any closer. Very well. Proceed as you wish, Dust.
Is that a tent? Is there somebody in there? Ah, whatever it is, it's got glowing evil eyes of evil. A merchant lies in wait. Do not let his appearance frighten you. I sense he only wishes to assist in our journey. Psh, I wasn't frightened. Just surprised at the, uh, savings. Come on, let's talk to him. I've been expecting you, stranger. Who are you? Merely a friend with many wares for sale. Shall we conduct business? Before you leave, might I propose an offer? That would depend on the offer. If I may be so bold, you are not prepared for the journey ahead. I, however, can offer assistance. Please, accept this blueprint as a gift. Should you find a blacksmith and the necessary materials, they may be able to craft the item for you. I can offer you materials as well, though I'm not entirely sure what materials this land deems of value. I am not from around here, as I'm sure you've guessed by now. Once you've sold me a new material type, I will be able to restock my store with it. As for your reward, I will pay you a bonus for the first new material you sell me. Ah, you'll buy them at a high price. I... well, yes. Yes, I will. Thank you. Watch your back, my friend. Not a problem at all. Stand back! Alright, I've got it. Wait, no! Ugh. Having some trouble there? Yeah, I don't know. I just can't get a good enough grip. Aw, you're just trying to show off. That's sweet. Don't worry about it. I'm sure there's a way to get up there. We'll just come back later. Looks like we're heading in the right direction. Be on your guard, Dust. I sense a powerful foe ahead of you. 
worry, Dust. I'll be behind you every step of the way. Way behind. Ah, it's another one of those spiky slime things! Their persistence, I'll give them that. Much as I pity this corrupted beast, now might be a good time to demonstrate the parry technique. Allow it to strike. Hey! You dazed it! Attack and hold the button at the moment of the enemy strike, and you will parry their attack, opening them up for a counterattack. Timing is crucial, and you must be facing your opponent. And as you can see, a successful parry may also daze your opponent temporarily. Now, put this beast out of its misery. I see somebody over there. Ask them if they've got anything to eat. We're in a bit of a hurry, Fidget. Don't worry, I'll feed you later. Hey, I'm not a pet! But, uh, I would appreciate that. Thanks. Oh, hello! You surprised me there. Don't get many travelers this far out of town. Sorry about that. It's nice to finally meet a friendly face. So, we're getting closer to the village then? You mean Aurora Village? Yes. It's just beyond those fields to the east. And I think you might be just in time. What do you mean? The monster attacks down there have been getting worse. Right before you showed up, I'd swear I heard somebody shouting. She's right, Dust. I can hear somebody calling for help further down the path. Let's get going. Yes, please hurry. Be careful. Don't worry, I think I can handle it. Exercise all you've learned, Dust. Send these foul creatures from this existence. yourself a worthy swords master and none too soon bah they weren't so tough i could probably take on another four or five of them you know if i had to and that's was there oh thank you so much what happened here i i don't know we were out here checking the fields when those giants attacked We've been having a lot of problems with smaller beasts, but this is the first time a giant has ever come this close to the village. Then the first step of your journey is near its end, Dust. The village lies just ahead. Yes, we arrived, and that's great. But what now? That has not yet been revealed to me. These people are safe, and that is what is important. Let us continue onward. Will you two be all right? Yes, I just need a moment to rest. I'm not sure how you did it, but you took down three giants single-handedly. 
Not a problem. That's what we do. Bringing justice to the weak and defenseless. Hey, who are you calling weak? <laughs> 